Claudia, thanks. Well, he is the most recognizable of the group of people who disrupted and vandalized the U.S. Capitol. A 33-year-old Arizonan in a furry headdress, horns, and face paint. ABC 15 investigator Melissa Blasius in federal court today as man faced a judge for the first time. Jacob Chansley, also known as Jake Angeli, made his first court appearance here in Phoenix telephonically from a detention center because he is currently in quarantine. We also learned from his mom that he has not eaten anything since Friday. He has not eaten and he needs to eat. Martha Chansley worried about her son's condition since he turned himself in to the FBI Saturday morning, a concern echoed by his public defender that 33-year-old Jacob Chansley had an extremely restrictive diet. We asked what the diet was. He gets very sick if he doesn't eat organic food, literally will get physically sick. The judge asking Chansley's lawyer to work with the U.S. Marshal Service on a detention diet as she held video and telephone first appearance hearings with inmates. Chansley was by phone and politely called the judge your honor throughout. He's a local activist and QAnon conspiracy theorist. At this point, he's facing misdemeanor charges related to being inside the U.S. Capitol illegally with a spear last Wednesday. Chansley was even pictured up on the Senate chamber's dais. Five people died, one police officer and four demonstrators, either during or after the violent clash at the Capitol. A second police officer died by suicide this weekend. Do you think he's responsible in any way for the people who died in the Capitol? Like I said, I don't have any comment. Chansley will be held in detention until at least Friday when he will have another hearing to determine whether or not he will be taken in custody to Washington, D.C. to face these charges or whether he will be released to appear on his own. I'm investigator Melissa Blasius, ABC 15, Arizona.